uh, what is my funniest story? Oh, good question, Barbara. Okay, so this is, is a pretty funny story. Here we go. I, I have a bunch of them, but this one I particularly like. So back in college, and I'm taking a film course on Israeli film because you have to fill up those credits somehow. They, they make you take all these general education courses. So I'm taking the Israeli film course, of course, hoping to meet chicks. And that did not go swimmingly for me. But as I'm sitting in the Israeli film course, you have to understand, Israeli film, particularly older Israeli film, now, now Israeli film has gotten fairly good. There are a bunch of modern series in America that are based on Israeli film, like Homeland is based on Israeli film. Um, there, there are a couple others. Um, in, in Treatment was based on Israeli show. But original Israeli film from like the 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s uh, is just Euro trash, particularly the 60s and 70s, just Euro trash. So there's a, a guy in my class and he is sitting behind me with this girl and this other dude. And the three of them, you know, I'm wearing a yarmulke in class. And, and we're watching this kind of Euro porn. And I'm like, oh, God, do I really have to watch this? It's ridiculous. And, <clears throat> and the whole time, they're just making fun of me because I'm Orthodox. And they're making fun of me. You know, are you, you're, you're a virgin until you're married. That must be really wild. Like, you believe in these sexual prudery. What the hell's wrong with you? Okay, so it turns out that the guy behind me, his mom is a star in one of these films. And in this film, as I say, it's like Euro porn. In this film, she is, um, shall we say, there's a shower scene in the film with this dude's mom. And honestly, I felt bad for the guy. Like the entire class is watching his mom in her 20s getting nude. And, you know, then proceeding to uh, copulate with more than one human being. And like I say, old Israeli film, no good. So the next week, and his mom comes into class and talks about it. It's awkward for everybody. The very next week, this guy is sitting right behind me. And he says, again, going off on the Orthodox thing, oh, you're Orthodox, you know, how can you even, that, that must be crazy for you. Have you ever even seen a woman naked? And I was like, well, you know, yeah, I live in American culture. It's hard not to. And he goes, well, who's the last woman you've seen naked? And I was like, well, your mom. Best your mama story ever.